Hi there, Silver Lake families. This is your assistant principal, Kelly Sutton, and I'm going to show you how to log on to your daily classes for synchronous learning. In the web browser, you are going to type in learn.fwps.org. That is L E A R N F W P S dot O R G, and then press enter. Once you are on the Launch Path for Learning page, you are going to type in your username and password. Your username is the six-digit ID number that you can find on Parent View. Your password will be Bulldogs1! Capital B U L L D O G S 1! Exclamation point you would type in your six digit username ID and then press sign in. Once you are on the launch path for learning, then you are going to go to Canvas. It is the icon with the red circle and many dots on the inside. Now you've made it to your teacher's Canvas page. At the very top, you should have your teacher's name and the class, the grade. You should have a welcome message, a welcome video, and as you keep scrolling, you will see contact information. Notice the email address, phone number, the school's website, as well as that class's Zoom link. Once you scroll down some more, you will see the online expectations. Every class has a week at a glance. On the week at a glance, you should see the scholars asynchronous and synchronous work. Then as you scroll down, this is a very important part. You will see the Zoom link for the scholars class. Another important part of the week at a glance is you will see the specialist Zoom link. We are trying to teach our scholars to go straight back to the Canvas page in order to log into their specialist time for that day. We are having some teachers put in the specialist Zoom link into the chat box. Again, we are training scholars to go back to the Canvas page and click on the Zoom link from the Canvas page. Also, on each Canvas website, there is a place that is called specialist and those zoom links will be there as well. Now I am on a zoom. Typically there are not just one person inside of a zoom, there are multiple people and the teacher will say hey it is time to go to your specialist class. From there the teacher will type into the chat box. So I'm going to pop up a chat. Here is an example of how a Zoom link can be in the chat box and you want to leave this current Zoom and go to a different Zoom. You would hover over the Zoom link. Then on your keyboard, you need to press the button that says CTRL. It is right below the shift button. CTRL, that is control. You press control first and then you click the link twice. From there, it will bring you to a new, all right, on the new web page, if a window does not pop up, you are going to click launch meeting. Next, a very important table will pop up. It says, you are already in another Zoom meeting. Do you want to leave and join this meeting? It is very important to click yes. This will end the current Zoom that the scholar is in and go into a different Zoom that with the different Zoom link that was clicked on.